This video is a shortened version of how to use the clipper belt lacer and to uh, lace a belt. And this is going to be a short one for, and I'm going to call it the ADD edition. So this is a number three clipper belt lacer. This is a four inch canvas belt and I'm going to install a lacing in here. And this is what the lacing looks like at size number four, which is about the right size, so I will install this in the teeth here. I cut the lacing to length with the standard scissors and now uh, I installed uh, the pin in here which will uh, hold it in place and I'm ready to remove the paper. That just needs to be pulled out and discarded. The paper is removed and this is ready to use and this four inch belting has already been cut square and sanded so it's perfectly square that needs to be uh, inserted and centered however you, you want it and then there are some pins right here and I will tap the belt onto the pins and hold it with a clamp so it cannot shift. The belt is positioned properly. I've tapped this with a hammer. I got it clamped onto the pins and it is now ready to uh, press on and then moving uh, the jaws of the clipper number three down like that I simply and you continue doing that until there is no more movement with the ratchet mechanism. So I'm getting quite a mechanical advantage here each time. And then quite a bit of pressure with the last one. Open it up. I can uh, remove the clamps. Pull the pin out. And there it is. A little close to the edge there. But you'll do the other end of the belt as well. And then using the pin made of either steel or rawhide or cat gut or an old welding rod, whatever you want to use, we can join the belt together. Hope you enjoyed the shortened version of how to use the number three clipper belt lacer. Thanks for watching. Tubal Kane saying so long for now.